Captain's personal log, Ramsey's reporting. I have made mistakes in life, but perhaps none so damaging as to encourage Dorothy Gale to join Starfleet. I had high hopes for her, but circumstances have turned a dream into a nightmare. Ensign Gale was once the poster girl for Starfleet. Now they can't wait to tear down all our posters. This unexpected situation has embarrassed Starfleet. Call it a misconceived recruiting stunt gone bad. I was surprised to learn that Starfleet had unique plans in the works. Excuse me, sir? You heard me right. A trial is unnecessary. What happened to justice? It's been dispensed. And the call went out far and wide. Starfleet wanted to sweep this under the carpet until I intervened. Perhaps my final downfall will be my weakness fighting for the underdog. And Ensign Gale was given a rotten deal. I can't forget the chain of events that forged this dilemma. And perhaps... I may have been rash in my zeal. Why do you like Starfleet? I want to explore the stars. That's my plan. Join Starfleet and see the universe. It all starts with the pursuit of a dream. The first step, Dorothy, is to believe in yourself. Don't let anybody tell you that you can't. If you want it, go for it. I'll treasure this. Dorothy Gale. Yes, okay. I see you are here on our list. Proceed. It seems like only yesterday that I arrived at the Academy. I'll support and defend the Federation against all enemies. I'll support and defend the Federation against all enemies. Your orders are to guard the Ambassador. I have orders to place Ensign Gale under arrest. The charge is murder. The evidence speaks for itself. Murder? Impossible! This is a setup, Captain. I didn't do it. Starfleet would prefer to keep this low-key. Please, sir. We're just following orders. Captain, please help me. I demand a court martial for Ensign Gale, Your Honor. You want a court martial, Mister? You got a court martial. All I know is that an ambassador is dead, and Zengale has been arrested and my career is on the line.
Sorry. Carry on, Yeoman. Here she comes. Who let her in here? Yeah, Admiral Robbins. Oh great, that's just what I need. Mean. Run into the Admiral. Yeah, he's been here almost every day. You know that Dorothy Gale case has been really good for the business. I really need a drink. Uh, shot of courage, please. Logically, she will drink herself under the table. She hasn't the guts to face her captain. She won't survive her captain's hot temper. She won't be able to muster up the courage. Perhaps I can get some diversion at Rama Baru's, the new space bar. And I could use a good drink. So, come on over. Have a drink. Hey! How are you doing? You? I see you too, man. We'll take you up on that. Bartender, I'll take a Martian special. Oh, the usual, of course. Change your ways much more academy time. No need to. I'm having enough problems with my ship. You and me both. You just get in? Yeah. You got recalled too? Yeah. This is a mess. Exactly. You know, just wish everybody would have gone from the routine channels as usual. Yeah, we need to uh, talk to someone about that later. Uh, well, see this will help a little bit. Seeing who's involved. Very good. Enjoy your drink, sir. It's a good drink, sir. Oh, fancy meeting you here, Captain. I wasn't aware the uh, USS Intrepid was in town. Oh, here I am, Captain Chain, these wonderful young Vulcans. That's our future engineers. Well, speak of the devil. Come join us, old buddy. There's always room for one more. Come on over. Come on over. Ladies. Join us. Sal, it's been quite a while. It has been. Sam? Good to see you. Same here. It's been way too long. Bartender, a drink for our friend. Uh, Syrian brandy? Make it a double. Well, of course. But of course. And your drinking habits haven't changed. Should they? <laughs> <laughs> Very good, very special. Syrian bread. I wasn't aware Starfleet was on maneuvers. Okay. So if you're not here for Starfleet maneuvers, why are you here? So why is the fleet in town? We can't talk about it. I get the message. Let's change the subject. So, Sal, how's life? You're still getting a divorce. Sorry to hear that, Sal. Yeah, it's tough. Pretty tough. And you, Sam? I'm doing great. I'm in the Admiral's list. Congrats. Thank you. Oh. I hate to kick the hornet's nest, but we're not here on a social call. So, why are you here? Really? You want to know? You really want to know? Saul, don't. Would you rather leave an old friend in the dark? We've been through a lot together. He deserves to know the truth. Saul, no, it's not wise. You haven't the courage to tell me. 
The truth is, we were ordered here for a court martial. A certain starship captain forced a court martial. Yeah, a certain ensign Dorothy Gale is to stand trial. Oh, I see where this is going. You're blaming me. Do we really have to clean your dirty laundry? Excuse me? Why didn't you trust our justice system instead of being so manipulative? And let an innocent officer go to prison? You really believe that? Innocent? It's not in her character. You're headed down the wrong road. And you're wasting our time. But it's the right thing to do. Hi, just checking in. Are you okay? I brought you some food. Are you okay? Are we finished with the small talk? <laughs> Sounds like you want to be left alone. Young ladies, life is about courage, you see. That's right. easy for you to say. You don't have my boss. Whoa, whoa, well, look here. Why don't you try this right here? I have something special for you. Yeah, this is what you need right here. What is this? Courage, more courage. Yeah, right. You know, convening a special court martial requires the presence of three starship captains. Did someone say three? Hey, hey Cam! Yeah, grab chair. a seat, join us. Bartender, a drink for the lovely lady, come on. Oh, but of course. I'll have a plain scotch and water. Scotch and water, absolutely. So, Kim, how's your new command? The Lexington. I heard you've been turning your ship inside out. The ship and crew needs work. So, Kim, are you here to give me a beating too? While I admire your crusade for justice, it is unorthodox. Justice. Justice is worth pursuing. That's a matter of perspective. Oh, and you're giving ship captains a bad name. Why? Because I want to follow my principles? So noble, yet so reckless. I'm willing to do whatever it takes. At the cost of your career? For a crazy ensign? That's the risk I'm willing to take. Why, Terry? Why? I made a promise to help her. Are you insane? Listen to yourself, man. Your intentions are misguided. I believe that she may have been framed. I would have admitted her to a psychiatric ward and thrown away the key. She's guilty, and you're just too blind to see it. On the other hand, everybody deserves a fair trial. Do I have an ally among wolves? Honey, I believe in fair play. Communicator. <laughs> I can't go out without it, you know. Oh, gentlemen, good day, good afternoon. <laughs> I don't know what it is. I don't know. I'm called to the ship. Let's begin. Let's go. There goes the neighborhood. Why are you staring at? What's his problem? If someone seems out of place here, it's you. <laughs> Boy, does he have an attitude. What part of the galaxy did he drop in from? Bartender, I'll take the blue milk. Of course. 
He's not from around here. I don't recognize the uniform. Scare me again, and I'll take you out with my blaster. A fascinating challenge. Blaster versus phaser? Who would win? Special Ops, maybe? Some secret organization? I can't believe you'll let Ensign Gale drag you down. And you're on a fool's quest, you know that. Excuse me, sir? What is it, Yeoman? Make it quick, I haven't got all day. I have a message from Starfleet Command. Spit it out. You are relieved of your command until completion of your jury duty. Thank you, Yeoman. You may go back to the ship. You're dismissed. No, I don't leave tips. What part of the universe do you think I'm from? It would be most unwise to mess with the Federation. I used to know who my friends and enemies were, and now I'm not quite so sure. <laughs> Wouldn't you like to know, young lady? Wouldn't you like to know? Promon secret recipe. What your secret recipe? So, off to work you go now. Yeah? Yes, sir. All right. Thank you. Yeah. Hello. What just happened? I can't believe it. Time will tell if I'm a hero or a fool. Am I giving Ensign Gale a fighting chance? Or am I helping to seal her doom? You drag us into this. Thanks a lot, buddy. We should be with our ships and our crew, not here. Don't mention it. I hate being dragged across the universe for this. I promise you this, Ensign Gale's gonna get what she deserves. All I ask for is justice. We're going to call it as we see it. If it's the firing squad, so be it. And what if she's innocent? And as Ensign Gale's jury, we have to do your dirty work? <sighs> That's right, old buddy. We're gonna finish what you started. I don't believe in giving Ensign Gale false hope, but this will be an uphill battle. And finding the evidence to save her will be quite a feat in itself. Her chances of being acquitted are, quite frankly, quite slim.